Hey folks, today even faster extruder calibration than before using Cura, a cable, and a caliper. Thanks to Wolf Pooter for assisting with this shortcut. Stick around till the end for a surprise that caught me off guard. All right, let's get started. All right, power up your printer. Open Cura and move to the monitor tab. Connect your computer to your printer. Preheat your nozzle to 205 and wait for it to reach temperature before proceed. Mark out 120 millimeters of filament. Reset your extruder by entering G92E0. Enter G1E100 F100. We're asking for 100 millimeters of filament at a feed rate of 100. Press enter to drive the filament. Once it stops, we're going to measure and record the difference. Okay, so now it's calculator time. We're going to take 120 millimeters and we're going to subtract the results of 27 to end up with 93. We're going to record that number. We're going to clear the calculator and now we're going to take 100 times the requested amount of filament, which was 100, and we're going to divide it by the 93. And we end up with 107.5. I'm just going to round that up to 108 for my test. Now I'm going to enter that G1E108F100 into the command line and drive the filament. Next I'll verify my results. Approximately 20 millimeters and we are very close now. And that's good enough for me. So my value is E108. You're going to enter that into the start code of your printer and I'll show you exactly where to do that. You come on over to the settings, you're going to go printer, you're going to come down to manage printers, you're going to come on over to machine settings and then you're going to place that line right here M92E108 extrusion calibration your number will be different than mine, but now every single file that you slice will use this number for calibrating the extruder. And now for the surprise that I promised you. I did a fair bit of testing to make sure this works, and I was surprised to find out that the difference of five degrees can have a huge impact on the calibration of your extruder. So most of my material, I run around 200 to 205, so I did my uh, calibration at 205 when I entered it into Cura. I hope this video is useful to you and if you have any questions or concerns please leave them in the comments and please consider subscribing. Check out these other videos.